today I'm gonna be sharing the best Mac cleaning apps to help you clear up space, speed up your system, and keep everything running smoothly. But before we dive in, do us a favor, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to ring the notification bell. That way, you never miss out on our content. Okay, first, I would like to recommend an app that I've been using for years, Clean My Mac. This cleanup tool scans your Mac storage to identify unnecessary files like user cache, system logs, language files, and more. It even helps you uninstall unused apps using the Applications module and remove large, old, and duplicate files with the My Clutter module. These features make it easy to get rid of what you don't need without the hassle of doing everything manually. I suggest starting with the Smart Care module, which combines key features like cleanup, speed optimization, app management, and malware removal. To try it out, grab the free trial using the link in the description and open the app. Once inside, you can go to the Smart Care section and click Scan, and then Clean My Mac will take care of the rest. The app has 25 tools to give you full control over your Mac, and they handle everything from uninstalling apps and clearing out leftover files to updating applications and optimizing performance. Additionally, the interface is beautiful and intuitive. Next is Daisy Disk, which shows you a visual map of your Mac's folders, making it super simple to identify what's taking up space and delete unnecessary files. To get started, you only need to select a drive and Daisy Disk will scan it. From there, you can review and delete files that you no longer need. To delete files, you simply drag and drop them to the bottom of the window and click Delete. You can also preview files before deleting them to make sure you don't remove anything important. This app has a different interface, but it is still simple to use. And with that said, some caution is necessary because the colorful charts may not always make it clear whether the files displayed are entirely safe to delete, so you might need to do a little bit of research depending on what you're trying to remove. Additionally, it offers both free and premium versions. The next app might sound familiar since it's from Avast, the well-known cybersecurity company behind Avast Antivirus. So in addition to their antivirus software, Avast also offers Cleanup Premium, a Mac cleaner packed with useful features. The app works as both a junk cleaner and a smart uninstaller. It can scan your system to remove unnecessary files, duplicates, and browser data, as well as uninstall applications completely. There's also a photo analysis tool that identifies similar or low-quality photos, helping you free up even more space. One standout feature is its startup management tool, which gives you easy access to all login items in one place, so no more digging through system settings to clean up startup clutter. Plus, the duplicate file finder can scan not just your Mac's hard drive, but also external drives, making it extra versatile. It locates identical files, folders, songs, and videos, giving you a complete cleanup solution. A great bonus is a 30-day free trial, giving you plenty of time to explore its features and see if it works for you. Next, App Cleaner and Uninstaller by Nectoni is a top pick if you're looking for a tool to uninstall apps on Mac. It not only removes applications, but also takes care of plugins, widgets, startup items, and app-related files. The app offers a clean and simple interface, making it easy for anyone to use. One standout feature is the drag and drop tool. You can drag any app into the app cleaner and an installer window to instantly see all the files the app has stored on your Mac. After uninstalling, you can head to the remaining file section to clean up any leftovers, ensuring a complete removal process. Another useful feature is its ability to remove startup programs. It shows you which apps and processes launch automatically when you log in, as well as programs that enhance browsers, apps, or system performance. It even helps identify unnecessary files and updates for a better system organization. Keep in mind, this app is focused on app removal, so it doesn't include tools for cleaning junk files, finding hidden files, or scanning your entire system. However, for app management, it's an excellent choice. You can try it with a two-day free trial to see how it works for you. And the last app is also by Nectoni, and it's called Mac Cleaner Pro. 
This is a versatile tool designed to clean and speed up your Mac, and once installed, the app shows you a detailed color-coded chart with your storage categories, similar to the breakdown you see in the About This Mac section. The interface is simple and user-friendly. By checking cleanup, you can view and delete junk files detected by the app instantly. It finds a wide range of removable files, including mail attachments, cache, trash bins, language files, installation files, screenshots, and downloads. And for each category, you can preview the files before deleting them, ensuring nothing important gets removed accidentally. In addition to cleanup, Mac Cleaner Pro includes tools for finding duplicate files, uninstalling apps, hunting hidden files, cleaning memory, and analyzing disk space. However, each of these features is essentially a separate app that launches individually, meaning the installation file includes six apps instead of one, which could be considered a downside for some users. Just like App Cleaner and Uninstaller, Mac Cleaner Pro offers a two-day free trial so you can explore its features and decide if it's the right fit for you. Now, before I conclude, what's your favorite Mac Cleaner app? Please comment down below. And make sure to watch our video on how to clean up your Mac. The link is in the description. And there you have it. These are the best Mac cleaner apps. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to ring the notification bell. That way, you stay in a loop for all things Mac. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.